Send emails from your C-sharp or any .NET application using Gmail SMTP. We'll use a simple console app for this demonstration and call it Email Demo. The objects required for sending emails are located in the system.net and system.net.mail libraries. These are part of .NET Core, so you don't need to add anything. The IDE should pick up these usings as you type your code. Our main method will simply call a send email method that will send the email for us. In the send email method, we first instantiate a mail message object. This will essentially hold the mail message details, such as from email to email, subject and body properties. Here we define the from property, which is a new mail address. This is your Gmail account from which you are sending the email. Then we set the to property, which of course is the recipient's email address. Note the add method indicates you can add more than one recipient. In our case, the recipient's email address happens to also be a Gmail account, but it doesn't have to be. Then we set the subject and body properties of the mail message. The body string can contain HTML. In that case, remember to set the isBodyHTML property to true. Now we need to set up the SMTP client. We instantiate a SMTP client that uses the Gmail SMTP with port 587. Port 587 is specifically for transfer layer security or TLS. Next, we give the Gmail login credentials of your Gmail account. The login name is of course your Gmail address, but the password is not your normal login password. Since Gmail is using two-factor authentication, using your normal password will fail. You will need to register an app password for this application inside your Gmail account security settings. We'll show you how to set that up in a moment, but just to finish the code here, you'll always set enable SSL to true, and then you can send your mail message. If you used your normal password, you'll get the following error. The client was not authenticated. Gmail needs a registered app password instead. To set up an app password, go to your Gmail account and manage account settings. In here, search for and select app passwords. Gmail will ask you to confirm that it's you. Then it will take you to your app passwords. Here, you need to enter your application name. In our case, it is email demo. Then click create. It will generate a 16 character password for you. Copy this password and paste it where you used your normal password in the credentials. Now, when we run our app again, we get our email sent successfully message. To confirm the message was sent, go to the recipient's mailbox and check for the new email. Here we see the subject line we specified, the sender, which is your Gmail account, and the body of text we specified. Thank you for watching our video. For more tutorials on C Sharp, hit subscribe and click the reminder. Give us a like so the video can be visible to more people.